A teacher in Sun Prairie is passing his love of creating works of art onto his students. News 3's Rob Starbuck travels to Sun Prairie High School to introduce us to this month's top notch teacher. How many of you are pretty much on course from your sketch? Our teacher Tony Bilgreen stoking his students' creative fire. This day, the challenge is ceramics. I don't really have a concept. I'm kind of just going with it. <laughs> just going with it. Isn't that the beauty of creating art? They're going to come up with their ideas, and they do sketches kind of things like that, preliminary work. And that's when I sit and talk with the kids and say, you know, this is what we're looking for, this idea. But really, it comes down to the kid, what they see or what they feel would be the best way to express who they are or what they want to show off as their talents. I'm making this for my mom because she does a lot for me. And so on. Oh, good for your mom because yeah. she does a lot for you. Yeah. You're a good man. Whether for mom or whatever moves you, many of his students discover talents they never knew they had. So many times, especially in my ceramics class that I have, the kids want to do something related to ceramics, to clay, or work on the potter's wheel, and they aren't sure if they're going to be very good at it, but they already have taken that first step, registering for the class. And by the end of the semester, they're really impressed. Hey, I'm actually a potter now. Considering this is what the students start with, plaster poured into plastic bottles, and end with this, illustrates there is some talent in this room. But this creative thing can be pretty exhausting, but rewarding, especially for the teacher. I'm blessed to have this school, blessed to have the kids here, and every day I come to work, I really enjoy working with the kids and seeing what they come up with. Yeah, it's supposed to be abstract, so why have a plan? Just go with it, right? Uh-huh. Rob Storbrick, WISC News 3.